Hello, 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 everybody. Today is Tuesday and it's toddler story time today. I'm Miss Lisa from the St. Paris Public Library. And we're gonna read some stories and sing some songs today together and have fun together today. But I'm by myself, so I'm gonna take my mask off so you can hear me a little bit better. So you're gonna get your shaky egg out or your shaky bottle, whichever one you have. And we're gonna start by standing up and we're gonna shake our hands or shake our bottles or our eggs. Here we go, you ready? Today I feel like shaking my hands. song. We wash the top and the bottom and in between. Okay, here we go. Top and bottom, top and bottom, in between, in between. Rub them close together, rub them close together. Now they're clean, now they're clean. Let's do the other side. Top and bottom, top and bottom in between in between rub them close together rub them close together now they're clean now they're clean good job okay our nursery rhyme today is zoom 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 and we zoom our hands just like we're washing our hands almost so here we go you ready zoom 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 we're going to the moon Zoom, 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 we're going to the moon. If you want to take a trip, climb aboard my rocket ship. Zoom, 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 we're going to the moon. Here we go, we're gonna count from five to zero and we're gonna blast off. Five, four, three, two, one, blast off. Here we go, we're gonna do it one more time. Zoom, 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 we're going to the moon. Zoom, 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 we're going to the moon. If you want to take a trip, climb aboard my rocket ship. Zoom, 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 we're going to the moon. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Blast off. Put your hands together. Blast off. Pshh. Good job, good job. Okay, I'm gonna move a little bit closer to the camera so I can read my first story for you today, all right? So here we go. This book is called, Let's Count Goats. The author of this book is Mem Fox. Here we are, you ready? Here we see a mountain goat frisking in the sun. And here we see a city goat going for a run. Look at his shoes. He has red shoes. 
but can we count the seaside goats? I think there's only one, and he's chewing on a red umbrella. There's a little duck. Here we see a drinking goat with his head in a cup. And here a goat is eating. He's not even eating the flowers. He's eating the table. What a silly goat. But can we count the little goats lost and loudly bleeding? There they are. One, two. Here we see an airport goat looking for her cases. She's riding around and around on the luggage carousel. But can we count the pilot goats with goggles on their faces? There's one, two, three, and they're riding in airplanes, yellow airplanes. Here we see a show-off goat playing on the bars. Uh-oh, he's gonna fall on his head. There's that duck. But can we count the rowdy goats careering around, careering round in cars? Look, there's a yellow car, a blue car, a green car, and a red car. There's a bicycle. Look, he's smart. He's wearing a helmet. Here we see an over goat. He's going over the bridge, and this one's going under. But can we count the crossing goats terrified of thunder? Look, there's lightning. Look, there's one, two, three, four, five. Here we see a sand pit goat playing with his toys. But can we count the trumpet goats making all the noise? Look, they're blowing inside the trumpets. This one's wearing a trumpet on his head. What a silly goat. Here we see a summer goat with nothing left to mow. He ate all that grass. Look how full his belly is. He might even get a belly ache from eating so much. But can we count the winter goats huddled in the snow? Look, this one, this goat down here, he has a stack of snowballs. He threw one, uh-oh, so we're gonna bonk that one in the head. Here we see a fireman goat climbing through the smoke. I wonder why it's smoking. But can we count the rescued goats trying not to choke? Look, they're trying not to choke on the smoke. There it is, birthday cake. Here we see a soccer goat roaring at the ref. That's not a very nice thing to do, is it? He has a soccer ball. You don't yell at the referee. But can we count the cheering goats who must be going deaf? Ray, yay, run, run, run. That's what they're cheering. They're cheering for the soccer players to run and run and get the ball. Here we see the story goats and all their shining eyes. Now, can you count their pricked up ears? You can. What are they doing? They're reading a book. They're all reading a story. I'm not surprised. Oh no, I don't think you're supposed to chew on books, are you? I don't think so. You're not supposed to bite books. Okay, listen, we're gonna wind the bobbin up so you need to get your scarf out. If you got a story time bag, you should have a scarf in there. If not, just get out your washcloth and we're gonna shake it and shake it until I get the music on, okay? Let's turn this on. Oop. Here we go. Shake it out. We're going to go round and round. Wind the bobbin up. You ready? Here we go. Do 
four. Clap your hands together. One, two, three. Pat your knees. Raise your hand up on your knees. One more time. Round and round. Wind the bobbin up. Wind the bobbin up. Pull, pull. Clap, clap, clap. Round and round. Wind it back again. Wind it back again. Pull, pull. Clap, clap, clap. Up in the air. Going to the ceiling. Down to the floor. Shake your scarf out, shake all your wrinkles out. Okay, we're gonna scrunch it up, then we're gonna count to five. You ready? Scrunch it up. Get it all scrunched up in your hands. Scrunch it and scrunch it. Here we go, you ready? We're gonna count to five. One, let me hear you count. Two, three, four, five, and toss it up. Catch it. Good job. All right. Let's shake it out again. Shake it, shake it. Ready? Scrunch it up. Scrunch it and scrunch it. Scrunch it. Get it all scrunched. Oh, look, I have a little tail sticking out. Scrunch it in there. All right. Here we go. You ready? We're going to count to five. Let me hear you count. Count nice and loud. One, two, three, four, five. Woo! Mine floats really good. All right, shake it, shake it. Last time, scrunch it up. Get it all scrunched in there, even the little tail. Get it in there. Here we go. You ready? One, two, count nice and loud. Three, four, five. Good job, good job, okay. All right, so we're gonna put our scarves down and I'm gonna come and read another story to, for you. So just give me a second to get a little closer. This book is called No More Biting for Billy Goat. <clears throat> it was Billy Goat's first day of school. He really did not want to stay. But Ducky came over to help him. She always greeted anyone new. Let's find your playgroup, she said. Look, there's the yellow duck. Billy Goat sat down all by himself. Bunny, Piggy, and Lambkin were playing a game with a big ball. Billy Goat wanted to play too, but he didn't know how to join them. Ducky was watching. You have to ask them if you can play, whispered Ducky. She gave Billy Goat a little nudge. Billy Goat tugged on Bunny's sleeve. Can I play, he said in a tiny whisper. Bunny couldn't hear Billy Goat. Billy Goat tried again. He whispered a little louder. Bunny didn't hear him, so Billy Goat nipped his tail. Bunny was startled. Ouch, said Bunny, don't bite. Billy Goat tapped Lambkin's arm. Can I play, she, he whispered. Lambkin looked at him. Billy Goat was getting frustrated, so he bit Lambkin on her chubby little arm really hard. Yow, she cried. Ducky ran over. Oh, Billy Goat, she said, you mustn't bite. You have to say in a nice, strong voice, please, can I play with you? So Billy Goat spoke up. Please, can I play with you? He said to Piggy in a loud voice. Okay, said Piggy, but don't bite. Billy Goat joined the game, but every time Piggy had the ball, Billy Goat grabbed it away. No, 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 said Piggy. That is not the right way to play. Billy Goat bared his little teeth. Then he bit Piggy's ear and he did not let go. Piggy squealed, he's biting me. Piggy tried to run, but Billy Goat would not let go. Bunny and Lambkin began to cry. Ducky ran over. 
Billy Goat let go of Piggy's ear, he started to cry too. He didn't like to hurt his new friends, but he didn't know how to play the game. Don't cry, Billy Goat, said Ducky. I will help you. Ducky taught him how to play the new game. She helped him talk to his new friends. Soon it was snack time. Now Billy Goat was using his teeth to bite his apple, not his friends. No more biting for Billy Goat, he said. Ducky put her arms around him. Right, said Ducky. Teeth are for biting food, not for biting friends. Teeth are for biting food, not for biting your friends. All right, we're going to sing a song about not biting your friends. It says, don't bite your friends. You can bite an apple. So find an apple. It's round like this. Crunch, crunch, crunch. You can bite a carrot. A carrot is long. Munch, munch, munch. You can bite an ice cream. Mmm, yum, yum, yum. But never bite your friends. You can bite an apple. Crunch, crunch, crunch. You can bite a carrot. Munch, munch, munch. You can bite an ice cream. Yum, yum, yum. But never bite your friends. You can bite an apple. Crunch, crunch, crunch. You can bite a carrot. Munch, munch, munch. You can bite an ice cream. Yum, yum, yum. But never bite your friends. Oh, that's a good song to sing and remember. When it happens, you can remind your children, use their words, help them to understand better. Usually biting comes from frustration when a child can't speak well or doesn't understand things and they use their teeth to, to figure things out. So biting is very difficult to handle, especially if you have a biting child. So sometimes it's, it's a little bit easier if you sing the song, you can bite an apple, crunch, crunch, crunch. You can bite a carrot, munch 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 you can bite an ice cream yum 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 but never bite your friends all right i'm going to move closer and we're going to bite read the last book i have for us today this book is called clip clop who wants a ride asks mr horse me please says the cat here's the cat and here's the horse there's a chicken. Clip clop, clippity clop. I want to ride too, please, Mr. Horse, says dog. Up you get, says Mr. Horse. Look, there's the cat riding on the horse, and here's the dog. He wants to ride too. Here he goes. Clip clop, clippity clop. What about me? I want to ride too, please, Mr. Horse, says pig. Up you get, says Mr. Horse. So look, there's a cat and a dog. Guess who's going to be up on there? <laughs> That's right. There's a cat and a dog and a pig. Clippity-clop, clippity-clop, clip-clop, clippity-clop. Don't leave me behind, says Duck. Up you get, says Mr. Horse. Can you go a little faster, Mr. Horse? Asked Cat and Dog and Pig and Duck. Uh-oh. Of course I can, says Mr. Horse, but make sure you hold on tight. Oh no. Clippity clop, faster, faster, clippity clop, faster, faster. Look at him, they're flying. He's going really fast. Clippity clop, clippity, 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 clippity. Here he goes. There's the cat, there's the dog, there's the pig, there's the duck. What's gonna happen? He's really running fast. Whoa, stop, we're falling off, squealed cat and dog and pig and duck. <laughs> there they go. <clears throat> Mr. Horse skids to a halt. That means he stopped really fast. And cat and dog and pig and duck fly through the air. There they go. And land in a haystack. Plop, plop, ploppity plop. Plop, 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 plop. <laughs> they all landed. Good thing that straw was there. That could have been a hard landing. Oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dearie me, says worried Mr. Horse. He was worried that maybe his friends got hurt. 
again, cried cat and dog and pig and duck. They must have thought that was fun flying off that horse. Up you get, laughs Mr. Horse, and cat and dog and pig and duck go riding off again. Clip, clop, clippity, clop. There they go, riding on the back of the horse. They must have liked that. That must have been fun. There, look how fast he's going. He's just flying through the, through the field. He's a fast horse. Okay, let's get a couple cup puppets. Do the chicken. Oh, here's my horse down here. Let's do a horse and a cow. And a pig. Let's start with a pig. We're gonna sing Old MacDonald How to Farm. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a pig, E-I-E-I-O. With a here and a there, here, there, everywhere. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a cow, E-I-E-I-O. With a moo moo here and a moo moo there, here a moo, there a moo, everywhere a moo moo. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a horse, like that clippity clop at a horse, E-I-E-I-O. With a neigh here and a neigh there, here a neigh, there a neigh, everywhere a neigh, neigh. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a chicken, E-I-E-I-O. With a buck, buck here and a buck, buck there, here a buck, there a buck, everywhere a buck, buck. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. I hope you had fun today with story time. We're gonna get our rosy bear out. If you don't have a rosy bear, you can use a doll baby or you can use your baby. <laughs> and you can do a baby bounce at this time. Or you can um, ring around the rosy with a friend. And um, if you have siblings, you can hold hands together in a circle and you can ring around the rosy or you can do it with just you and your child. So here we go, you ready? Ring around the rosy, pocket full of posies, ashes, Ashes, we all fall down. Boing, 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 boing. Okay, we're gonna do it one more time. So stand up if you ring around the rosy at your house. Here we go. Ring around the rosy, pocket full of posies. Ashes, ashes, we all fall down. Boing, 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 boing. Thanks, rosy. Put one hand way up high. Wave goodbye, it's time to go. Wave up high and wave down low. Wave real fast, uh, and wave real slow. Wave goodbye, it's time to go. Wave up high, wave down low. Wave goodbye, I'll miss you so. Mm -hmm. Love you. Be good listeners today, and I'll see you next week.